Hello everyone, Bentley K here. Welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. Today's video is a hot flash and wrinkles makeup video and we are gonna be testing out this. This came from my Amazon haul that I showed you guys a little while ago. This is the Ariana New York Lash and Eyebrow Tint. We are only gonna do my lashes because it only comes with dark brown and black and I don't think I need dark brown. As you can see, I'm re reinventing my brows. So I'm basically drawing them on where I want them to be and not plucking them at all, which is really driving me crazy. <laughs> but, you know, I gotta let them go werewolf on me so that I can get the ones I want, get them the shape I want them in. This is the shape I like. It's a little bit dark, but I was going wild today. I haven't worn makeup in a couple of weeks and I just was ready for something very bold. <laughs> Anyways, moving on. So, anyways, when I, I already recorded the project, you know, when we tried it out. And so I'm gonna play that for you now because my, I had a little technical difficulty when I was recording it. My card got full and I didn't know about it. So it just kind of ends. But the only thing you guys don't get to see is I'm, I'm applying it. So you get to see me applying it and then it just kind of fades out and that's it. <laughs> but after that, I just set the timer for 15 minutes and I didn't notice that the card had had gotten full until it was like when I went to turn it back on to show you guys me wiping it off and that it wouldn't play. So anyways, um, I just wiped it off with a, with a dry cotton pad because it says not to wash them or wear makeup for 24 hours. So I just wiped it off with a cotton pad and then now we're back. And so I'm gonna play that for you and then when it's done, I will come back and give you my thoughts on, on the whole project. Okay, here we go. We're gonna do this. We're gonna be using this Ariana New York Lash and Eyebrow Tint. It has, and this says lashes up to four weeks. And there's like 10 applications in here. I know that I watched a few videos on how to do this on YouTube. And they were using this other one called a thousand hours and it's set up to six weeks. So, but this one also has um, claims of being um, more organic. It is the next generation of semi-permanent hair color system designed for beauty lovers who desire optimal performance suitable for lashes and eyebrows giving long lasting color and definition combined with Ariana New York lamination oh that doesn't say okay it is PPD free pop paraben free ammonia free vegan and animal cruelty free so maybe that's because that's why this doesn't last as long it's well, it only claims to last four weeks and the other one claims to last six weeks I doubt either one lasts as long as it says but we're gonna do it anyways so the first thing we need to do is oh I'm gonna tell you I'm gonna use this but this is the little thing it gives you to mix it on and I've got these little things that I got from my glitter um, nails so i'm going to use this instead because this just it also says this is a lash guard and it's like how can you mix it on there and use it as a lash guard didn't make sense to me it also came with this little brush and i think i'm just going to use i have this bag full of spoolies that are like throwaways and so i think i'm just going to use one of those to apply it and to um stir it up so it says to clean my lid and lash with a oil-free makeup wipe, which I have. This is a Quate, but it says alcohol and oil-free. So that's what I wanted. So I'm just gonna do this. We're not doing my brows, just my lashes, because it only has dark brown and black, and I don't think I need dark brown. I need to grow my brows is what I need to do. I've been putting castor oil on it at night, but only for a few nights. I got the black organic castor oil. That's what, a long time ago I did a video about growing my brows. And somebody said, it has to be black organic castor oil. 
And so that's what I got this time. And I'm really hoping it works. This is the second video I've made with no makeup at all. But, oh well, you guys need to know, right? So this is the true me. And I have had my lashes off for like a week. Because I was going to make this video and I kept putting it off. And then you're supposed to dry your lashes completely. Because I've just been really lazy. And I haven't wanted to do anything. I haven't wanted to go anywhere. Oh, I do have some news. My grandson in California is getting married. So I will be going back to California in July. And my granddaughter, his sister, one of his sisters, is turning 16 and she's having a big sweet 16 party because she lives in California and that she, all, a lot of her friends are Hispanic and they got these giant uh, quinceanera or something like that. Uh, when they turned 15, these giant parties where they all were formals and it was just crazy and she wants one of those, but she's not Hispanic, so... So anyways, she's turning 16, so she's going to get a sweet 16 party. And that will be two weeks after the wedding, so I'm going to be there for like 17 days because that way I get to go to both of them. Anyways, I think they're dry. And you can't even see that I have eyelashes, but I do, but they're not very long. And that's because I wear, well, I don't know if it's because I wear, um, false lashes all the time, but that certainly doesn't help. So now I'm going to use this brush that they gave me. Well, no, I'm not. I'll save that. I'm going to use a Q-tip to put Vaseline on my lids and my, and these little things that go under your eyes. They have sticky things to them. I think, oh yeah, you just peel it off and stick it on, but I'm just going to put Vaseline so that, just in case. But I don't want to get Vaseline on my eye lashes, because then the um, dye won't stick to the, to the hairs. I'm going to do, and so I'm just going to put Vaseline on the bottom and the lid without getting any on my um, lashes. So yeah, I'll be going back to California in three, two, two and a half months, which is kind of soon, but you know what? I'm up for it. I had a great time when I was there. You know, I started to buy those stickers where you stick on your eye to make the this hair, skin like tighter just to use while I did this, but I don't want to wait for it to come, so I didn't. Now, this is probably not going to stick, but maybe it'll stick to the Vaseline, or maybe the Vaseline will make it not stick. Anyways, I'm going to try. If it doesn't work, I've already got, um, it's going to stick to my fingernails. I've got Vaseline down there, so. Oh, it's stuck. Feels kind of weird. That's okay. It's just a precaution. I need another one of those. Oh, here they are. Put another one of these on. And you just peel this off the back. Probably did not need Vaseline under my eye with this, but I feel like it's just added protection. Okay. There we go. And I know when I watched them, the ones, the videos, 
that you can wipe it off really quick with a Q-tip. And I like these pointy ones just in case. These ones that have they have pointy at one end and then they're flat and round but there's no fuzzies to them. I like these. All right, so now I'm going to put this stuff in here. And I, it says to put equal amounts of the color and the cream, like a pea size amount. So we'll see how well I can get that to come out in a pea size amount. This one's the back black one. I know, difficulty speaking, it's because these things are on my eyes, I can't talk. All right, I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see, but I'm gonna try. Make it so you can see and I can see. And they said it comes out yellow, but it will change color as it develops. Okay, see? Yellow. And this is the cream developer, so let's see if we can get the same amount. Can you see? And there's none coming out yet. Oh, there's a little. Wish I could put my glasses on. I think that looks like about the same amount. Equal amounts. And hopefully it's plenty for my lashes. All right, I'm gonna use this and just mix it together. Well, now that I'm looking at it down here, it looks like there's not as much color as there is. So I'm going to add a little bit more of this yellow stuff, which is black. All right, now that looks more like equal amounts. And then I'm just going to take this and stir it together. I hope it's enough. I don't want to have to mix it again, but I will if I have to, because it's kind of gone, kind of really gone. Yep, I think I should mix more. I think I will. So, pea size amount is not enough. Two pea size amounts might be enough. And then you have to leave it on for 15 minutes. Where's my phone? It's in my pocket. All right. All right, I'm gonna start putting it on. And I'm gonna start by closing my eye and putting it on top. Now, the other kind that they had was black. You could see it. So I'm gonna say that I might have liked that better. So you could actually see for sure where you had already put it. Okay guys, what did you think? I know it faded out and that's bad, but that's what it did. I'm sorry, I apologize. Anyways, my only problem I had with it, with this product, is that it was yellow instead of black. The one that I watched, I know I, I mentioned it in there that the, I watched a few videos on YouTube of other people dyeing their lashes because I wanted to know how to do it without, you know, messing anything up. And they all used that one that was called 1,000 Hours. And it, when you, you can see it, it's black. That is my only problem with this one is that I couldn't tell if I'd gotten it everywhere. So, I mean, when I was done, it was, it was black. I'll show you a picture. I'll put a picture up right up here. No, up here. No, up here. I'll put a picture up here and let you look at that for a second. And as you can see, they, they're black, they dyed black. There's a few on the edges that probably didn't get any stuff on them. But other than that, it worked great. 
Um, how long it lasts, I don't know. It's probably been a week, maybe. Yeah, it's probably been a week since I did it, and they're good, but then I, I went ahead and put my lashes on because that's what I wanted it. I wanted it to be black so that I didn't have to put mascara on them, and it did. So it gets a thumbs up, but if you're like me and you have blonde lashes and you put yellow stuff on them, can't see it very good. So if you're like me, you might want to get that other kind, but... It did work. I do like it. I will probably use this a few more times because it, it says it has 10 um, applications. So I'll, I'll still use it. And But then next time, oh, another thing I was going to tell you is next time I use it, I won't use those stickers under my eyes. I will just put Vaseline on the top and on the bottom and then use a spoolie and just put it on like mascara because you have plenty of time to take one of these and wipe off any that gets on your eye. And that would be so much easier just to do it like that. It'll be quick and easy. And that's my thoughts. I give it a thumbs up. I think it worked really good, as you could see in the picture. And I'm, I'm, I'm happy with it because I did not have to put mascara on. And it looks good. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for watching my videos. And I'll see you in my next video. Mwah!